Were you really that busy last week? Why the f didn't you watch the Kasharskis? Man, here's what you missed. Okay, so we're at the post office. GameStop going out of business sale. Josh, I'm trying to film. Oh, great. So I got all of those. So yeah, I just bought an entire GameStop. <laughs> Mother, just, just calm down. I have one of the rarest systems I think I've ever bought in a lot. I think everybody should be on board with what Josh was doing. How much was these red dits in the window? Me and Josh have found a random flea market on the beach. How much I saved? $6,872. Cause we're going to Texas! Woo! It's Wednesday morning. I just left my place. I'm going to pick up Josh. Cause me and Josh are the only two going this time. It is foggy as hell out. I cannot see two feet in front of my face. Uh, today's gonna be interesting. And I'll see you guys later. Whoa. So me and Josh are heading out for the great state of Texas. We stopped by the flea market. Uh, we're grabbing some of our stuff from the booth. And we're gonna head on out, so... The, the next video footage you'll see is on the road. I don't know if we're gonna get any bridges this time. Uh, Cause I know how much you love the bridges. I might get a couple just for fun. But, anyway. I will see you guys when we get to, and on the way to, Texas. Yeehaw! Look at that. Look at that. It's the Oscar Mayer Wiener Mobile. Get your wiener on. Sure. Hi, sweet okay. Max. Okay. Hi. Did you get a, did y'all get coupons? What? All right. Let's get you some coupons. Wiener Mobile. Oscar Mayer Wiener. Yeah, you're welcome. There's Josh. There you go. Okay, what do you like so much about the Wiener Mobile? No one likes that but you. You, you like Dylan's Wiener Mobile. Look at that. There's a lady, there's the Wienermobile, and then next to the Wienermobile, there's a lady protesting the Wienermobile. Let me see if I can get a good shot of her. Look at that, it's about to go down. We got the Wieners. Anyway, only here in Florida, only here. Me and Josh just hit our first stop. We are at Love's. Let the Texas trip begin. Oh, we just, we're eating at Hardee's, we're at Love's. What's Gas up? Station. What's Ooh. up, Mr. Greg? Uh, Greg, oh, where's Mr. Greg? Where, where, where's this Mr. Greg? Greg's there. Yeah, the bike just coming. AMC at 14, okay, cool. Um, so yeah, Josh is scratching. This is our first Tico. Sorry about that, guys. Um, come on, baby. Come on, baby, I need a winner on my first Tico. Here, pick that up, let, let me see, did we win? Not yet. Hello? Uh-oh, oh, uh -oh. oh Kay's calling. Come on, Josh, come on. I wanna see what the first Tico is. Please, please. I don't want this to be a forever clip, let me see. Let what me am see. I supposed to do? Come on. Come on. Come on, Joshy. Scratch faster. I'm trying. Not looking good. Is it looking bad? Womp, no womp, symbols. womp, womp, womp. Did you scratch the numbers? Scratch them all right now. Okay, here comes, here comes the number scratches, guys. This is how we do out here in the hue. This is our, this is our Dallas extravaganza. Come on, Josh, you match me a number, baby. No bonus numbers. No bonus numbers. Is that a loser? Yep. Dang it. Bum, 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 bum. So Josh can't go a city without buying lottery tickets. Every city we went to, he bought at least a million lottery tickets in each city. He's, he's, like, he's, like, a, he's like, he needs Gamblers Anonymous or something. I don't know what the hell he needs, but Josh, 
Stop wasting all of our money on these trips that you could be spending giving me a portion of the money towards the trip on lottery tickets. Just stopped at a second Loves. That's the second one we've been to on this trip so far. We're getting back on the road. We got some grub, got a double cheeseburger. Josh over there chow chowing down on some jerky. And I'll see you guys when we get to the next state. Woo! Well, look where we're at, everybody. Wow. Oh. There's a stupid amount of games, games in here. The store is awesome. All these figures. Oh, yeah. Yo, Chiu. Awesome. Look. Look at all these. Down a level. Oh, they have it and they know. Yeah. All right, look at all those. As we so we were in a game store. Yeah, we were in a game store way up here on the top of Florida. Josh just made a hundred dollars, hundred dollars. Sold some Pokio cards um, and a Wii remote. Yeah. So now Josh is back in the game. Been he can recoup game. all those lottery losses for the last stop that you been guys been didn't been see. Been Luckily, it was only like they twenty bucks. So we were splitting on fives. Anyway, and I'll see you guys in the next stop in the next state, Alabama. Oh, here's one you're going to like. Are Pokemon cards and sport cards, I guess cards in general, are they worth buying to resell and why? I don't know. Maybe if you did your research, you would know. So you don't sell any sports cards or anything? Yes, I sell sports cards and Pokemon. Well, do those... Hottest thing on the market. Video games. Stop at the center. Huh? We should stop at the welcome center. Uh, we don't really have time. No, we do. I can take a piece. What do we get? Is that it there? Yeah. There's no way. No, that wasn't it there. Yeah, that was. That's not it. it no, because we didn't see the, the, that's not the. That's not the welcome center. Oh, is it? Yeah. Dang it. Well, where's the sign that says Sweet Home Alabama? Because we're in Alabama. Yeah. Dang it. Crap. Maybe there's another one. Well, ladies and gentlemen. Something smells like burning rubber. I know, that smells bad. Hope that's not us. This is the point of the trip that we all know and love. Show everybody on the stream, Josh. Aaron wants you guys to see the tunnel. Yeah, we're in the tunnel. Look, we're in the tunnel of love. Woohoo! Yeah. I love this tunnel. I don't know why I do, but I love the tunnel. We're in the tunnel. We're under the tunnel. We're about to come out of the tunnel. Yes, Herbie, it's a vintage Nike. Somebody's just buying the e-brake. Huh? Five dollars. Yeah, five dollars. It's over. not a five dollar shirt. Wait, is that what they're saying? We're riding the e-brake? We're not riding the e-brake. No, we're not. But anyway, yeah, we're out of the tunnel now. Woo! It's not five dollars. Guarantee that. Did you really think I would reboot the show and do season five of the Kasharskis and not have tunnels? Think again. So we just stopped at a pawn shop over there and, and they had a bunch of sealed games for like Switch and everything. And I'm like, oh, so how do you get all these sealed games in here? And he just with a calm face like, yeah, people steal them and bring them to us all the time. And I'm like, what? Okay, yeah. That's not legal. We'll stop at the next one. And we need to get out of wherever we're at in Alabama. Josh is out there scratching on a Tico as we speak. We have Mississippi Lottery Scratchers. I'm going to scratch this one off here in a second. Uh, but yeah, doesn't look like, I don't think he's won on that one, but we'll see. I'm going to try and scratch this one, and I'll let you know if I won anything. To hold this. Like, the f 24. You one, told me to f hold this. 19. 4. That's a seven. Check this again. Twelve. Thirteen. Five. Twenty. Thirty. Nope, no winner. Bum, bum, bum. So I'm going to relate this story for you guys on YouTube and you guys watching the stream also on YouTube. So at the gas station that we were just at buying lottery tickets, Josh went to the bathroom.
Yeah, no. And he might have sort of locked himself in the bathroom for almost the door 10 broke. minutes. The, the door broke. Door broke. He couldn't get out. The, the gas station attendant had to go pry him out of the bathroom. It was the funniest story I think I've seen in a while. But yeah, so that happened. The fans want to know, Josh, how did you lock yourself into a gas station bathroom? I didn't lock myself. The <laughs> door was broken. <laughs> Me and Josh just ate dinner at um, Chili's, ate Chili's, and now we're on our way back. We're gonna head back and get to our first hotel of the trip. Here at a hotel in uh, one of them states, Mississippi. And, uh, oh, wrong way. Anyway, Josh is happy because we're right next to the uh, soda machine. And this, my friends, isn't a bad room actually. Oh, this is actually kind of cool. It's kind of cool. We got a mini fridge and a microwave. Hell yeah. So this is our very first hotel. I'm stupid excited to be here because we have not done a convention or a big trip in forever. And I know it's just me and Josh on this one. Mama K didn't show up, but this is really exciting. This is really, really exciting. The first trip into Tucson. This is the maiden voyage of the Tucson voyage. to Texas. Because now Green. we know, now we know, now we know that gas is going to be a lot cheaper. Because no, we're... It's free right now. What is? Gas. Yeah, we all free for you. Ugh. We just said, we just did at Chili's. Ugh. I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. That smells. We are leaving the hotel this morning. I do want to give you an update on the GameStop thing that's going on. So, so I sold my shares, as I met, mentioned earlier. Well, Robinhood is now no longer allows you to trade GameStop or BlackBerry or AMC or or there's like another company like Naked Company or something like that. Whatever the whatever the companies were, they're getting all messed up. But but they are now attacking Dogecoin. And I'm hoping that, that they win the fight with Dogecoin. There's Dogecoin right there. It's at 1.4 cents a share. Now, if you want to know why I want Dogecoin to do so well, it's because I've been pumping money into Dogecoin for some time now. And I have 20,000 Dogecoins. I'm up $140 right now. And if Dogecoin can go to a dollar a coin, which is where Wall Street bets, the subreddits and all that are trying to get it to go, I have 20,000 coins. So if you wonder why I want them a dollar coin, that's why, because that would be twenty thousand dollars. Josh is over there asking me if I got enough cereal. They got continental breakfast. I'm gonna take full advantage of this continental breakfast. Because this might be you might not always get continental breakfast at all the hotels. So when we do, I mean Uh-oh. Get over. Get over my Uh-oh. Get in the left lane? In the left lane! I'm getting in the left lane! Oh, get in the left lane. They're letting me go. I'm just trying to figure out what the heck's that. Do you text and drive when you're on trips? Not like Aaron does. I don't text and drive at all when I'm on trips. What do you He's like? in there watching all kinds of stuff. TV and everything. We are now driving past the Mississippi Welcome Center. I say this specifically for Josh, because, no, we're not stopping. I'm not stopping at the Mississippi Welcome Center. I'm saying that because that means that if we pass out, oh, casinos, once we pass that up, we're in Louisiana, baby. Woo. The best way to tell that you're in Louisiana is when you're crossing the Mississippi River. Now, the Mississippi River was founded in, actually, I have no clue what I'm even saying right now, but this is a bridge. This is the Tinker Toy Bridge. That's the Tinker Toy Bridge. Um, we're crossing it, and I'll see you guys when we get to the other side. And uh, we are now in Louisiana. Lottery time. Woo. There's Josh, the Josh and Dylan's favorite store, Lion's Den, the Dolph Superstore. Woo. There is the sign. I saw the sign. It said, Welcome to Louisiana. Saw the sign. Woo! So we're here in um, that place there, Louisiana. And we're scratching. This is a $10 ticko. Oh, yeah. I don't know why I'm talking like that, yeah, but. Nothing? 
How do you tell? I mean, the $10 is a symbol, huh? Oh, wait, wait, oh, it's a symbol? Yeah, 10 times lucky. Wait a second, so so there's no there's no winning numbers here? No. Wow. In the Koreans? Well, ladies and gentlemen, we've just entered Te Tejas. Welcome to Texas. Uh, you can't mess with Texas. Everything's bigger in Texas. So, here we are. There was a sign back there. Normally it says don't text and drive. Granted, and here I am filming driving. Anyway, it said, it literally said, check yourself before you wreck yourself. Don't text and drive. So maybe this isn't a good video to be posting as I'm driving, but it was texting. It, did say, it said nothing about filming a video. But again, check yourself before you wreck yourself. Texas, yeehaw! So we're about to witness some greatness right now. So Josh over there is playing lottery tickets, and he lost a bunch in a row. And I bought a 10, a 10, because I want to snipe him for the winner on this Tico. But um, the main thing I want to talk to you guys about is, is this. I'm up $1,000 right now because everybody made fun of me for having Dogecoin. I am up 343%. And if we go to my details, I'm going to show you this right now. This is live. While we're in Texas, my Dogecoin, I have $100 into this, and it's at $1,100 right now. Bouncing around. I'm up. So, here, hold this. I tried to snipe him, but I did not snipe him because I lost. But it doesn't matter because I don't care about that $10 because I'm a crypto millionaire. This is the second hotel that we're in. This one actually looks better than the last one. And it was only like $72. So we're about to see what the inside looks like. Oh, shoot. It's bad, right? This actually looks pretty nice in here. We got a video. the size of the TV. Where? The size of the wow. This is a really nice room in here. Turn all the lights on. So these are our digs. We got a closet over there. We got a kitchen. We got a sink. Easy. And then we got a pull out pull out couch in case somebody wants to room. This is a yeah, I don't want to pull out. I don't. <laughs> anyway, this place is nice. Really, really blurry, but also nice. Wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey. It is the morning. It is Friday morning. Guys, we are gonna leave the hotel and we got a couple things we gotta do today. We gotta go set up for the con. Before we set up, we're gonna go garage sale hunting. That'll be a totally separate video that you'll have seen months before this one. Uh, Cause season five doesn't come out for a while. But anyway, I will see you guys at the setup. This is once again, our lovely hotel room. And thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys at the setup. Okay, do you sleep in at hotels? Or do you get up early? Both. <laughs> what kind of f***ing question is that? So Josh is currently hiding behind the snack machine. And uh, where'd he go? Where'd he go? Yeah, he's fine. I'm behind the snack machine. We gotta go, Josh. We got stuff to do. This is what happens when you get to Dallas and you get nothing but highways and interstates and byways. This is crazy talk but we're almost here to set up for the con. When I'm in Dallas, or when I'm in Miami, or Orlando, or wherever, there's they always have these highways and byways, and when there's like four or five of them, like loop-de-loo and circling around, I get so lost, especially in Dallas. In Dallas, there's like a fork that leads to another fork that leads to another fork. So you have to constantly be staring at your phone GPS because if you miss one of the forks, you're going 20 minutes the wrong direction. It is so frustrating. Guess where we might be going this week? Six Flags! Oh, hey, there's the gas station we hit the two hundo at. Yeah. Yeah! Woohoo! Aaron's going to Six Flags. If you want to learn how to punt $80 at one stop, Josh is showing you a clinic on how to lose money. That's punt 200x. I think we just got 200x. Where? Oh, yeah. I just hit a 200x. No, you didn't. 200x, man. No, you didn't. Show you in a minute. Yeah, he's lying. He's lying. Wait. Did you hit? No. Bump, bump, now. Let's go. 
Okay, Josh's over here trying to get in. I'm about to snipe. Four losers in a row for Joshy. No, it's um, the same ticket. I had number six. What? I had number six. Show me. No, he's lying. He's lying. Yeah, six. No, yeah, five. Yeah, and then five. Six, seven, eight. No, and then five. Yes. Yeah. No. So here we go. Here we go. This is it. This is going to be the snipe. Yeah. So I haven't scratched any numbers off yet, but what do you notice? What do you notice about that? You notice a five mother freaking X. Okay, so five X. Five X, guys. Small zeros. Yeah, man. Hey, 50 still good, though. Are you sad you didn't get to go to Texas with us, and are you going to Dallas later this year? I couldn't go to Texas with you. I was in a hospital, remember? I, I remember. Dallas, I would like to go, because I need a vacation, but don't know if money will allow it unless the boss pays for it. Meaning Aaron. The whole trip. We have arrived at the Bob Duncan Center for the event. Now we just gotta find Greg. This is one of the rooms they're gonna be setting up in. And then over there is other rooms. That's the main floor. Uh, us and Greg are gonna be set up right there. This is gonna be so awesome. This is, this, this isn't even a big palooza. This is a little palooza. But guess what? We here. We have been working at this for hours. Um, Greg brought all of his pops. And uh, here's some of my stuff I'm setting up. Uh, you could actually uh, see what we got. We got the stadium events there because you got to have that uh, at a con. We got Wii stuff. We got Super Nintendo. PS5 stuff. PS4. Of course, the Mama K Polar Pop, uh, or in this case, the Josh K Polar Pop, uh, PS3 games. I'm not done yet, uh, by the way, but yeah, this is what the setup is so far. There's all the DS games. I had a bunch more systems. The guy next to me cleared me out already. I made $200. The con hasn't even started yet, and I'm already at I'm already at over $200 selling that to him. And also, I want to show you this. I got look at this. I'm not done with this yet, but this is a work in progress. This is my eBay table. So everything on here is listed on eBay. But uh, yeah, this is gonna be a very exciting and, and adventurous con convention. Um, you guys will have already seen the convention by the time this video goes up, because this is gonna be in the Kacharskis episode, which will air later. But yeah, this this is technically a retro Palooza Dallas. It is, I'll be in Dallas twice this year. There's the eBay table. Josh, ready to leave? You really just say eBay table and point the camera at me? Yeah, I was asking if you were ready to leave. What intro is that? So there's Josh. Here's one last good look at our booth. Uh, we're about to leave and go get some grub. But uh, yeah, we'll see you guys uh, when we go to get food. Can't wait for this con. We are at free play. Woohoo! Who's the best at Pac-Man? Not you! Boom! 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 Uh oh, Josh is, up, Josh is over here playing the arcade, the pinball machine. Will he win? Will he lose? I don't know. You can do it. You can do it. Oh. No, but I don't think you can do it. I, I don't think Josh can do it. Well, Josh can't do it. Wow. Yeah, we're here. We're hanging out with Greg and uh, Jay from the Game Chasers. And, uh, yeah, Josh is trying to do this right now, and he is failing miserably. He is failing miserably. Okay, go, go, go. Oh, what's up? Whoa, 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 wh
whoa, hang on. Bring it in, bring it in, bring it in, bring it in. All right, we're here at Retro Blue Swap Meet. It's a small event, it's a one day event, but it brings motherfuckers together, right? Yes. Aaron? Great, Josh, here we go. Drinks up. Woo! <laughs> so I heard you and the game you and the game chasers got a little crunk at an arcade one night. I care to explain what happened. No, I actually don't. We're at an arcade. That was all. We had fun. We had a good time. Josh. What's the mirror say? What's the mirror say? What does it say, Josh? What does that say? I'm coming, I'm coming. Leaving the hotel. Wait up, Joshy. Let's go. Me and Josh are here at Dave and Buster's. Email. Don't oh. pull my email. I don't what? care if the trolls have it, but no. That's no. a J. No. Look at that. That's a J. I'll edit it out anyway. That's a J. Oh, sh they have this machine. He be doing it. Why is it every time I film you playing that stupid piano arcade game, you magically forget how to play, and it takes you 12 tries to get a decent score? No, all piano machines are rigged. They're all different. Here's an idea, Josh. Maybe leave the piano playing to me. No. You're not Mozart. Mario Sonic at the Olympic Games. Hey, Josh. I know you're playing the claw machine, but I found your game. Look over here. It's the Stay Puff. Galaga. That was fun. Look at my final score. 42,000. Cruising blast. Oh, 
Alright, uh, we have this back at our place at the celebration station. Alright, we made these. Go for the thousand Coke and a Coke. I don't know, round and round she stops.
they take me to see things. It really is. Don't crash, Joshy. A 30 and a 20. What is this bonus reveal? Three Let's bonus? go. Let's do the bonus. Let's do this. Um, you got anything yet, Joshy? No, it's not looking good. I need. I mean, it's looking good for me to come in and snipe, but. Nah, we're gonna hit something. If not, we'll have to meet up tomorrow. He's, he's still pissed because I sniped him earlier for that 50. Uh, womp, 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 womp. Well, oh man, it, come it, on. It would appear there's no winners on this ticket. We still got three matches. Nope, you lose. Okay, lottery. Mm. Lottery. Okay, so I didn't want to get this whole ticket, but 
He's scratching away. He's getting spare. close to winners. He's on the very last row, and I'll keep you guys updated if he wins. You know, win. Okay, come on, get the moonrise. Do we have it? Do we no. get it? Is there one more left? There's two more, but I'm the cactus. There's two more. And the oil rig. Cactus, oil rig, anything, anything, anything. Cactus. Cactus. No, I don't think we hit. Bump, 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 bump. We stayed at so many different hotels. I don't even remember how many hotels we stayed. It's at least five or six. We were bouncing around from one hotel to the next. Uh, there's just so many hotels. I love going to different hotels, seeing which ones have hot tubs, you know, which ones have indoor pools, outdoor pools. Uh, we stayed at a hotel that was in a casino. That was awesome. I mean, I just, yeah, the whole atmosphere, it's, it's awesome. It's like, you're, it's like I'm on permanent vacation this year, and I love it. I can finally afford to take trips. Well, we're at our next hotel. This is not a good sign. Next time on the Kosharskis. We're under attack. This is my favorite place to eat. Yep. Oh, this Here one says spit happens. These are the babies. No. I have 10x zoom and that looks like a fire. I have the fire trucks, or as Josh would say, the fire Fs. Well, I'm here at Bug Guys. <laughs>